Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to go on a new adventure to New Mexico and we are going to hike. Wheeler Peak, the highest peak in New Mexico after we climbed Humphreys Peak, the highest peak in Arizona. Yeah, this will be the highest that we've been in the United States now in preparation for our upcoming trip. Kilimanjaro! So we're going to show you right now just what we do to pack our car before we leave. We used to just be more backpackers and now that we've got a car that can fit stuff in it, we're trying to come up with a system that we'd like to share with you on how to fill up our car with all the stuff we need for a nice road trip. So we're going to try to keep it as minimal as possible. Ready? Let's do it! I like to start with the trekking poles because we pretty much won't need them until we start hiking. So I'm just going to put them all the way in the back of the car. We have a big tote dedicated for all of our sleeping systems. So in this tote here, we have sleeping bag, we have bedrolls, we have the jet boil, we have camp shoes, I think we have a pen, we have pillows. And usually when we go uh, car camping, just the two of us, we even fit our two people tent in this tote. But right now, we have someone else who's joining us, so we are going to need a bigger tent. But pretty much in this tote, we are able to fit all of our sleeping system. We just like to keep it all in one place so that when we have to set camp, it's easy to do. We have this lamp that we take with us when we go car camping. It's pretty efficient. You can even charge your phone if you want to. So I'm just gonna slide it right here. And now it's got to go. So then the next thing would be the cooler. This is a medium-sized cooler, I would say, just uh, two people. And if you, we have any perishables or anything that we would like to keep cold, we would place it in the cooler. I have some uh, date and pecan balls that I made the other day, so I'm keeping them in there. Um, I have some fruit, and then we'll probably grab some water and some Gatorade on the way and keep it fresh and cold. Okay, so the next thing is the tent. This is what I was talking about earlier. Like I said, usually the tent goes in the tote, but not today, so I'm just gonna slide that in there. Stakes and poles, everything is in there. Next up, I've got this uh, basket where I leave all of the non-perishable food. So in here, for example, I've got some uh, backpacker meal, just in case we need them. And then I have some stasher bag with the oats, powdered milk and pecan for breakfast. And then I have these chickpeas that I baked at home. They are really, really tasty. And then also, I've got a bag of most of the snacks that we are going to need when we go on our hike. Chewies, I've got some bars in here. So all of the snacks, they don't really have to be in the cooler um, since the AC is gonna be on. And I have a bunch of apples. I've got spoon, fork. I've got a spice wheel as usual. And I've got some apricots and then honey. So really just all type of food or utensils that don't really have to go to the cooler would stay in this basket. And I'm just gonna place it right here. Uh, I think we have a big chair that also needs to go in there. This bad boy, I think I'm just gonna place it on top just like this or maybe my goal is just to be able to access the cooler whenever I want to, and I think that should be okay. And then we've got this big duffel bag from Aria that we bought not too long ago. We love this uh, duffel bag because it's collapsible, and we have all of our hiking clothes in here, so pretty much everything that we will need for the next three days or so is in this duffel bag. So let's see, is that gonna be a problem? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, much better. And then finally, we have our hiking shoes. They are pretty dirty from our previous adventure, so let's have them in this reusable bag. And I'm just gonna place them in here. We will probably stop to get some water. So obviously, we don't have much water. But we do have space in the back seat, so water can probably go in there. But this is the setup. We've got our cooler, we've got food, we've got our sleeping system, we've got our clothes, pretty much everything that we need. That is pretty much it. I asked, you said you wanna see the setup. That's the setup, and I hope that you guys find this to be useful. And don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up if you like it, and we will see you soon on a new adventure. Bye.